because I like it. That's not what I wanted to do. <laughs> I love the turning in this game. I wasn't, I'm not really gone for that long. Oh, it's a somber smithing stone. Okay. Six. Okay, so 125 plus 25, 150 plus 101. Didn't increase the scaling. One forty three physical. So it does more magic. I'd have to I'd have that's one fifty. I mean, it is higher um, attack power overall, I assume, if you added them up, because it's appearing before this one. Okay. Is there a special attack to it? Back already, no matter. Then can I give it... Yeah, I don't think you can give those Ashes of War. This is where you can mess around with your weapons. Oh, nice. Although I kind of I like the carrion great sword thing more than that, but we're switching it up. I don't know why I decided to rest there. That's exciting. Wait. Oh. Oh! Rear Gale Tunnel Entrance. Could I have entered from... Limgrave? Oh, maybe. Yeah. Could have done this before. I guess I never really checked this out. There's a lot of attacks that can be avoided in this game by just casually moving to the side. I, 
the trolls all pissed off. Wait, are they still chasing me? There's a tree over here. Let's go check that out next. Um, I should I should rest here though. But if something happens, I'll respawn. There. You can see where that marker is. That's where um we found the scar seal. And also, why are they scarred? Wait. Do they are miss are they missing an eye? It's a scar seal. Oh, sorry, not a scar that's been sealed. It is a seal. Huh. Yeah, the seal. That is a scar. whole area down there. That's where the tree is. They came out of the ground this time. about this free like this. Oh, wow. It has damage over time. Oh, cool. Or it is just one. I'm surprised they don't allow you to upgrade magic. But I guess it's you upgrade the stat as opposed to the individual. You upgrade the individual weapons. Why not upgrade the ma individual magics that you like? Instead. to go down there to get to, to there. Okay. Faded early flower. That's the church. Yeah, okay. Just making sure. And that, that's where we were getting our butts kicked before. So lonely. You can see they're infected with scarlet rot too. Transient light. Yeah.
the bracers. It took me a second. My my mind's a bit slow tonight. I've been I've been playing this a lot, and I'm loving it. I'm so excited. I uh, this is the twenty. Or sorry, the I'm recording this. It's June fifth. DLC uh, twenty twenty four. DLC comes out on the twenty first, and there's been like a bunch of first impression videos that have come out today. I haven't watched any of them because I'm still on the fence about watching stuff before I go into the DLC. Engraved golden bracers worn by the guardians of the minor Erd trees. In accordance with an ancient pact with the Erd tree, it is said that their deaths led to led not to destruction, but instead to renewed eternal life as guardians. That might look kind of cool. Little gold action. Yeah, why not? That just looks totally foolish. <laughs> I can't. I Are you back to this? I think I'll stick with what I was wearing. Perfumer's traveling garb. Uh, I mean, it's... I don't like the gold. It's actually kind of better. Okay. We don't need to kill all these guys. So they died and they came back in service of the protectors. Service of the minor Erd trees. To be protectors. Whoa! You could do it. I believe in you. That was wild. That that phantom there looked like they were attacking that guy. Uh oh. Yeah, even the explosive part of that isn't that great. That's what it does. That's so good. <laughs> we're getting, we're getting powerful. Oh God. <laughs> we can still get our butts kicked by these guys. I'm starting to feel powerful, though. Oops, I didn't mean to. It's trying to dual wield. I mean, that's so sweet. I wonder what kind of, uh... Tree root guardian, this will be, or whatever they're called. You guys might be noticing a theme here. Trade Avatar. Uh oh, I'm dead. I thought it was dead.
Wow, okay, I got rotted bad. I think we'll I think we'll probably keep our distance from this one. I had the right idea initially. Oh, there's more of those guardians up there. That's is that where some of them are popping down from? Oh, they're behind rocks and stuff. Be pretty, pretty clever. want out their outfit. I think that would be a cool outfit to to rock for a bit. be smart to just go ahead and I didn't mean to crouch uh, heal up to max six fifty I was just curious what's gonna do the most amount of damage Oh god. Still, I bet you if all three hit that 9,600. Green burst crystal, flame shrouding cracked crystal. I imagine it's going to be the meteor still if I hit with all three. Of course, it depends on the enemy. This is going to be stamina. Resulting concoction temporarily raises one's maximum stamina, and this is stamina recovery. Fire attack boost. Glintstone Comet Shard, though, I think is still the best spell so far. If I had to rank them, what are the ones I've used? Ah, yes. Dude's like, you ain't gonna smash me! I could end up like these fellers. Oh, is that where the arms would have been? Oh, nice. I think I'll walk this one. It's 
So I think um, y'all reminded me of why these are... So these are like pots that didn't work out, I think. Filled with the remains of warriors. And sometimes they come to life and sometimes they don't. And these are the ones that just didn't come to life. They just put them around the Erd trees. Like a offering, maybe? I feel like I should change the helmets, but there we go. There's 20. I like having the extra int, but it's not that much, is it? Oh, it's it's six. That's a lot of intelligence. I think we've got better range now with this sword too. It's been really fun playing with magic. Like I said, I, I don't normally do it because I try it like once and I'm like, it takes too long to cast spells and... Oh, look at that. Secrets. So I usually just forget about it. Now, is that a secret, or are things just going to kind of wrap down to there? Oh, God. Oh shit, is that rot on the ground or is it because I'm standing close to those things? I don't think it's damage over time. I think it's just, oh yeah, yeah. Oh no, it's just one a one time thing. Wait. Yeah, Scarlet Rot's nasty. That does damage over time. Wait, did that not cure it? Uh. Oh. Am I just getting it again that way? That's for bleeding, isn't it? Oh, I think I was using the wrong thing. <laughs> it's like red, but yeah. Let me double check. Let me double check that because it's certainly not removing it. Blood loss. There it is, preserving boluses. Sacramental blood. Exceedingly rare to find. All right, you won this round. Elden Ring.
also going to give me the rot. In fact, I think I caught it from standing in there. And maybe I got hit by these guys a little bit. Charge it takes three. If I charge one, it takes. Who's throwing shit at me? I put an illusory wall on one of these areas. As it gets to a certain point, it kind of just. Doesn't go down, does it? Huh. Why isn't it going away? I like the I like the blood teardrop. I'm gonna take a look at the rest of this and then we'll go back. Sometimes I get just lazy with my fighting. Sounded like there was one walking around behind me. I'm just, I'm feeling one. I'm feeling one here. I don't think they put a torch on it. Yeah. This 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 is one of those ones where you had to see that or you would it gives you like a sense. It's letting you know it's like this way, right? It sounded like that's where that noise was coming from. So you're probably gonna be like if you didn't notice that you're probably gonna be like, oh there's an illusory wall someplace. But it didn't sound like it was below us. Maybe it goes up. Oh, okay, okay, okay. We, I forgot about these stairs. Just, 
just, you know, I thought I could get some more light. Double up that light. Ugh. Miyazaki just cannot help himself. <laughs> With the poison pools. He actually he actually said that. He's like, I don't know what's wrong with me, I just can't help myself. Is it worth it to jump? I uh, you could totally miss that. Oh yeah, I'm with you. Thief friend. Just crabs. Little crabs? Gravies. I'm going to put a message here. Because people might miss that. by putting forward there. We'll know to go forward and then right. Okay. Jumping into it definitely helps. It didn't go up a whole bunch. Okay, prediction for this boss. Huh. Some like. Is it going to be another headless? No. A rotten, rotten hound thing, hound cat. No, no, I have no idea. I wasn't totally wrong. We run out of ideas. Just put both of them in the same room.
One down. Okay, I'm kind of running out of mana here. I'm out of mana. Oh shit, I'm out of healing. No, I have mana. Oh no! Oh, I didn't need to do that. I should have just attacked. So scepter and sword. I mean, not a bad prediction. I was kind of like, there isn't really a theme here aside from rot. And I don't really... Yeah, I wasn't really feeling anything else. And it's an Erd tree thing, right? So... I'm trying out some different things because it's fun. I think I could just rain meteorite, put some meteorite on them, but. Just it's it it attacks too slowly. Does one of them have two? Does one of them have two? The one has three heads. Yeah, that was a nice shot. I think they both have three. Yeah, it was just the angle. Time, please. One attack at a time, please. Oh no, don't do that. Oh no, oh no. That's actually... Uh, all right, all right. That deserves a victory achieved. That was pretty tough. The mad pumpkin head ashes now. What a game. 
Oh yeah, I never read this one. The Jarrite Puppet. Spirit of a man who wished to become the innards of a living jar. A jar hurling specialist who throws all manner of pots and jars. The warrior jar once told the nameless man this. Oh, I already, I already, I already read that. We read, I did the voice. Spirit of a mad soldier with a large brawny physique. Though he has stifled his panic with the dark confines of his helmet, he rampages as if driven mad when agitated by bloodshed or the humming of insects. This mad soldier is all that is left of a broken gladiator. That would probably be a pretty good summon. Every single time. Whole head. Once again, we're getting a sense that there was some process that was interrupted here, or that's been corrupted, where they would bury the dead. And I'm not sure if it was all dead. It seems to be certain dead, like the people the most faithful or something to the order in the earth tree, and then that would that would recycle the life. Or maybe it was promised that it would when it actually didn't. <laughs> it's like be, they're just farming the life. I can't get over to there, eh? Yeah, so the only way to get there is from the underground. That's neat. I could just teleport back up to here, because that's a dead end, it looks like. And let's continue checking this out. We had popped down here previously. I'm a little hesitant using that too much in case I kill some NPC. By accident, but... Oh, they're... Look at that. They're fighting each other. Dino dogs. Literally Tyrannosaurus Rex. Incoming! <laughs> oh, but I got this thing I've always wanted to use. Oh, damn. What happened? Oh, there's what? Who's that guy? Oh. <laughs> Where was that entrance way? I want to check that out. Oh, it's sound. Fleshy. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. I 
I mean, that was neat. Destroyed this section of the wall. That might be too far. Yeah. Uh oh, we're in trouble. I mean, you could have had a home. It's designed to jump there every time just to just to do that just to destroy the buildings like each of them because it wasn't really jumping at me and it jumped forward how many of these do i have left Fourteen? Hell yeah. Oh, Sword of Saint Trina. Who's the 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 one that's related to sleep, right? Silver sword carried by clerics of St. Trina inflicts sleep ailments upon foes. St. Trina is, is an enigmatic figure. Some say he is a comely young girl. Others are sure he is a boy. The only certainty is that their appearance was as sudden as their disappearance. And the skill is Mist of Slumber. Releases a faint purple mist that spreads across a wide frontwards area. This mist inflicts the sleep ailment upon foes. We're going to hear a lot more about St. Trina. I think we already talked a bit about it, right? I'm just not sure how much I said, so I don't want to speak out of turn here. But scales of strength, dex, and int. But um, there seems to be something with... And I think I mentioned this before. Mikola's Lily, Trina's Lily. Thought to be beloved by the Imperial Mikola in his youth. And unalloyed gold started to fade and wilt. Also wilting, it's on the verge of wilting. There's some other connections we'll discover as we go. What did it say about Nicola on the Scar Seal? That's Marika's Scar Seal, not Nicola's. My bad. That's why it has that rune on it. I got them confused for a bit. Or did I? I don't remember. Okay, that makes more sense now, because for some reason I was reading that as Mikola. That's Queen. That's the uh, Eternal Queen, the one that's missing. Okay, okay. So that's even more interesting that we found it there. Making a connection maybe with the Nox. Like we found this. Uh, shoot, I don't remember where we found this. Was it in Rhea Lucaria? I think it might have been. Or we found this in Rhea Lucaria, right? Or one of, maybe we found both of them? This we found at the bottom of uh, Nakaron. The bottom of a um, waterfall.
Actually, well, right where that marker is. Right here. down there. Oh god. I don't think I explored much of... Uh... Caleb when I played this first time. I think I kind of just glossed over a bunch of it. just not it's not really fresh in my memory that's for sure this kind of stuff i like that they refill your 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 flask it makes sense for the op oh god for like the open world concept so you can keep you can keep going Oh, are you chewing on your buddy there? Ugh. Place is fucked up. That's all there was here? There should be more of it. Oh, you're gonna kill me, aren't you? Not today. What? I'm barely doing any damage. I unequip my weapon, didn't I? Oh no, I have to two-hand it when I'm on the worse I forgot about that I was like, why am I not, why is it not dying I was hitting it with the friggin staff I don't know I just thought like maybe there'd be some items on top of stuff trees I hear the frickin' thing. I could have sworn I heard a scarab. the music maybe it's the music or it's like or it's invisible or I'm losing my mind. 
I guess the area is kind of barren. See, I, I would be hearing it more often, though, if it was just the music. see it that's what I was hearing <laughs> okay I was it was driving me crazy because I was hearing it every once in a while Is there a knight? Yeah, okay. I think you can see them better at night. Shoot. Okay. I think it was coming from the other way before, though, wasn't it? worked out well last time. Oh, it might go back and forth. Here it comes. Fuck. <laughs> Wait, well, should I use the ice mist? The freezing mist. I don't know how much damage you have to do. You just have to hit it once. Are you fucking serious right now? Didn't work. Flame of the Red Mains. I have a lot to learn about Khadan. That's going to be fun. Oh, it's an Ash of War. Flame of the Red Mains. Uh, skill of the Red Mains. So that's what the their army is called. His army is called. Who fought alongside General Khadan. Produce a powerful burst of flames in a wide frontward arc. Okay, I, I think I might... pop into... that castle... afterwards. Or next, I should say. Sweet. I feel like we're, yeah, we're now we're feeling, I'm feeling like I'm not ahead anymore on levels. We're kind of at par. So let's go ahead and do some more leveling up. thousand Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> Wait. Shouldn't that have been enough? Am I... Are, are these getting siphoned off or something? I mean, I didn't fully map it out, but... Oh, we're getting 800. Okay, maybe... I might just be getting tired. Definitely been pushing it. But I feel good. Feels good to, to get a lot of work done. Because I so, I so can't wait for the DLC. I'm so excited.